Hello and welcome to the PC Machine at Tech Help Show. I'm your host, Craig Chamberlain, and we're on the free software series where I show you software that is actually falling under the licensing agreement of freeware or open source. Freeware, of course, is free for personal use. Open source is free for both commercial and personal use. Today, I'm going to talk about advanced system care. Now, I've used this in a, some previous videos before. I'm going to say some new features and some reasons for using it in this one. So if you see my videos before, this one's still worth watching. Go ahead and select it and download it and we'll get started. Now, after you've downloaded, of course, navigate to wherever you downloaded it to and select the file to open it. It's in Chrome on mine, so it's just in the bottom left-hand corner of my browser. Then select it Run, actually, to run the installation. Now, once this comes up, you're just going to click Next, and it's going to ask you to read the licensing, licensing agreement. Again, it's free for personal use. This is freeware. Select Next. Of course, select your location. I usually keep it default. It says I already have it existing because I'm basically reinstalling it for your demonstration purposes. And click Next, and then click Next again. And I'm going to create a desktop, not a quick launch, and I don't want to add IOBit to my favorites and click next and then click install. After it's completed, of course, just uncheck the update history.txt and click finish. Now this software will actually check for updates on its own. So after we've ran through the wizard, we have the advanced system care free screen and sometimes it, it does the automatic scan right after you've installed it. Go ahead and stop the automatic scan. Check off the spyware removal, registry fix, and junk files clean. These are the three we're going to want to run. By default, they select all of them. And they've actually caught a lot of flack. This is made by IOBit and they actually stole their spyware removal definitions from Malwarebytes anti-malware. Now, a lot of people will not use this software based upon that fact only, but this is actually not a very good piece of software for spiral removal. Anyways, Malwarebytes always have, has, and always will do spiral removal better than advanced system care. That's not why I actually have you download this software. It's just a built-in feature in this overall package. So go ahead and select the maintain windows. Make sure these three are checked and select scan and clean it once it's found any issues in your computer. Then select the diagnose system and we want to do system optimization and security defense. Now the optimization is actually the reason I have people download the software. It is basically the bread and butter of this software. It is the major advantage. It'll go through and optimize your registry and your system and your graphics settings for basically optimal use, optimal use. Now in the options section, you also want to make sure under general, you're on checking these three because you don't want it to start or run in the background or start on boot up and things like that. But one of the greatest features of this software is under system optimize. If you do the, decide to go with a professional version, you can actually select what you do use your computer for and you can select if it's daily use, entertainment, top performance. Now those are just for the professional version. I keep it at basic and you do get a lot of advantages on basic and you can select your network type and do an optimization based on that as well. So go ahead and select apply and select OK and then run the scan here and then run the clean. That's pretty much all you're going to get out of the Advanced System Care Free Edition. Remember the Professional also includes this nice little Turbo Boost feature which will automatically disable useless processes. It'll clean out your RAM and things like that running in the background. You can keep it running all the time. It also includes that unique system optimization for whatever your targeted system is looking for. So it'll disable certain functions you might not need. But other than that, if you have any issues or any questions about Advanced System Care, just leave it in the comments below. If you have an opinion, leave it in the comments below. If you have any thoughts, leave it in the comments below. If you're just extremely commenty, leave it in the comments below. Thanks for stopping by. Don't forget to leave comments and ratings and don't forget to subscribe and leave it in the comments below. Thanks again.